absolutely everything. Okay, so I don't know about people out there, but I have a huge sponge phobia. My, I would get, get one of the. You had one of these. Ick. Okay, okay, this is exactly it. And I can't even tell you, like, I'll go into friends' houses. I, I'm awful with this. And I look and see a sponge like that. I'm like, do you want to be using this sponge to be cleaning the counter, cleaning the pans? Well, let me just tell you, 1.2 million have been sold of our amazing Debbie Meyer Genius Sponges. I swear by them. But today, you are getting a configuration that I don't even have yet because yeah. I have not yet tried the scour. But on our website... 4.7 <laughs> stars, huge customer pick, an exclusive configuration, and it is not just any normal sponge. It no, is it is unlike any other sponge okay, that's ever been created. Sponge, Tell me about it. The yeah. word sponge is where it stops similarity. It's not, exactly. Okay, okay. <laughs> this is a sponge, and this is horrible because that's what you probably have next to your sink right now. Right. And when you walk past your sink, do you say to yourself, what stinks? Is it in the dream? Yes. No, it isn't. It's right. your sponge. And I'll right. tell you why in just a moment. Have a look at these. These are my Debbie Meyer Genius sponges. On the front, they're both my sponges. My sponges are created to inhibit the growth, and this is independent laboratory tested and proven, inhibit the growth of molds and bacteria in and on the sponge for the life of the sponge, which is also amazing. Uh -huh. Each sponge is the equivalent of 15 ordinary sponges. And I'll these do the things. math for you in a moment. <laughs> but you turn them over. One of the kind of the sponge has a green backing. That is a scrubber that's also made with the same material and same everything uh, uh, inhibiting molds and bacteria. Right. It is a rinse-free scrubber. So if you've ever gotten scrambled eggs stuck in a scrubby before, mm -hmm. it won't happen mm -hmm. because now you just rinse it out. It rinses mm -hmm. clean. And it has the ridges. I think that has also ridges. helps for that. My new sponge, this and you're getting in the pack as well, you're getting 12 of my original ones with the green. i got to make sure I've got my name upside down. <laughs> and then you're going to get six of my brand new scour sponges. Silver scour. Although it feels very soft to the hand and it will never get hard and it won't hurt you, it is an extremely hard-working scouring Fine. side and that is Great. for things like your grills your make sure it's it's cooled off first yes <laughs> you're going to clean that. your grills the bottom of your pans anything that is not non-stick you can use this on however this one with the green is safe for non-stick my glass top stove i use it on mm -hmm. and they will always say soft they will oh they will never smell right. and i want to show you some science before i show you some math so let's let's do the mm -hmm. science first so you understand okay. the difference and why i have so many millions of sponges so that is what is on and in your sponge right now if you were using an ordinary sponge. And you see those little things? They're not just there, they're multiplying. They're growing. And that's what stinks. Yes, when bacteria exactly. multiplies, it stinks. When this, you're transferring it to everything else. In the and picture. this is a picture of the a dramatization done by the independent lab that shows that my sponges will not support the growth of molds and bacteria in or on the sponge. Exactly. You call so it's a cleaner, yeah. E. coli seminal, black mold and stuff we can't mm -hmm. pronounce. So let me do some math for you, okay? You're gonna get an 18 piece set of my sponges. Right. Six of the sour sponges, 12 of my uh, scrubby sponges. That means, because every sponge is the equivalent of 15 ordinary sponges, right. thank goodness this is light. Oh my gosh! You are not gonna have to buy 270 sponges. That's it. Eight. 170 sponges in this oh, box. Man. This is what you don't have to buy. I was throwing one of these away a week because That's I couldn't stand That's the what idea. I, same thing, once a week. I out. wouldn't throw it. I wouldn't put it in my microwave as people say. Oh, clean it in your microwave. I wouldn't do oh, that. Oh yeah. Because why would I put this disgusting thing in my microwave I know. where I put food? I don't right. want bleach. I don't want to have to clean the thing I clean with. So instead of having to clean the thing you clean mm -hmm, with, mm -hmm. what you did simply do. And the do, cost of 260 additional ones. Rinse it out. It's you out. rinse it under warm. Uh, well, and it also water. has like what 40 percent. More water, so it has a sponge. huge water retention. But to when it. you put this down in the morning, or you put this down after you've used it. Next time you pick it up, it's like having a brand new sponge mm -hmm. because it doesn't, it, it won't support the growth of anything. So watch this. I made a mess. Yes. Yeah, nothing new. Nothing new. <laughs> we like that part. Right. So what 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 do I do? I don't even wipe it up. I throw my sponge down on top of it, and I let the sponge yeah. do the work. Watch the absorption. It's right. It's going. It's growing up into the sponge, and eventually it'll create its own dam between itself and the water because it yeah. is absorbing. Watch. Isn't that amazing? See the water go? Yeah, that the is amazing. The water just went. Look at this. The water's moving. Yeah, there is nothing like these. I mean, watch, watch again. There it goes. 
And here's an item also, Debbie, that you've got to buy, right? I mean, there's something we Look, use every single day. It's virtually dry where I had the sponge just sitting. So if, where do you have the most water? In my house, it's the bathroom. Bathroom. Okay, mm -hmm. bathroom sinks. I've got mm -hmm. one of these next to every bathroom sink. Everyone just goes like this. They just yeah. wipe up their own water. Yep. They sop it yep. up. I do put the it same down, thing. And I don't have to worry about this thing being smelly or stinky after right. it's been used right. several times because this will never smell. It will never get hard. The backside is made of the same material, just a different formulation. So it has all the great um, attributes of the front of my sponge. Remember, this is scientifically proven to inhibit the growth of molds and bacteria in and on the sponge for the life of the sponge, and that's 15 times longer than an ordinary sponge. Exactly. When you're washing things, let's say you, do, you wipe out your sink, oh gosh, you know what? First of all, your sink is the dirtiest place in your house. Everyone says, oh, bathroom. No, it's your sink. sink. Because in your sink, you've rinsed off things like the chicken. Maybe mm -hmm. you've, you've thrown some mm -hmm. food scraps right. in the sink because you're going down, the, down to the um, disposal. Yeah. You're wiping it out, you're wiping, then you go do the dishes. Then, oh, let's wipe off the baby's things here. Mm -hmm. You know, oh, mm -hmm. no way, he dropped this on the floor, right. let's clean it. Yeah. What are you doing? If you're using this, you've just put this I know, on everything I know. in your house. Absolutely. So get rid Absolutely. of that because that is frightening to me. This and my, my silver sponge and my scrub mm -hmm. sponge, scour sponge now, the, with these two sponges, these are, oh, look at that, I'm upside down again. Story we cannot life. have that. Story of my life. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even stand on my head. Okay. <laughs> With these two sponges, this is all you need in terms of cleaning. You, this cleans absolutely beautifully. It rinses completely clean. You just squeeze, squeeze it under it running water. When you put it down, it, it's an absolutely new sponge. Mm -hmm. Let me show you the, over here. I want to move over here because I want to show you some examples of what you can use the scour side on. Because remember, this is heavy duty. Right, and when these are news where a lot of us do not have the scour side. Oh, by the way, as we do done. this, we're also going to go to Nevada, Nevada. Okay. So you can say hi to Brenda. Hello, Brenda. It's a pleasure to have you where with you us. Been? Oh, there you are, Brenda. Hi. Hi. How's, how's everyone? We Wonderful. are fabulous. So let me ask you a question now, Brenda. Have you tried Debbie Meyer Green Boxes before? Because we understand you bought the uh, bread boxes. Yes. You have. I, have had, I bought them a couple of years ago. I bought a set for my daughter-in-law. <sighs> But I, the most exciting part of the entire set are the bread boxes. Yes, <laughs> yes, um, yes, that's a first for us too. So let me ask you a quick question. Have you tried the Debbie Meyer Genius Sponges yet? I have not. This is the first time I've seen them. Oh, oh my gosh. You will have them for a very long time and you will be absolutely thrilled when you use them. Uh, Brenda, this is the this is one of my pots. I'm embarrassed to say, and that's what it looked like on the bottom. Uh huh. Well, I used the scour, the silver side on this one. Look at the difference. Yeah, absolutely. I do well, real demos. This is not this is not painted on. This this and is that's without chemicals from my too, kitchen. Then, right, Debbie? Uh, sorry. That's without chemicals. Without chemicals. This is the natural ingredients in this sponge. Look at this beautiful stainless steel pan. Again, it, I'm embarrassed to say this was mine. I'm going to try there. Look at that. Look at the difference. The side that wasn't scrubbed, and then this is like absolute satin. That's only using my sponges. And I, I didn't do anything to those pans other than use my scrubby. So I think you should you should definitely try these, Brenda. Add them to the bread boxes, Brenda, if you right. can. Okay. Yes. Well, it was great talking with you. you I too. just want you to know your products are wonderful. Thank you so much, Brenda. Thank you very much for taking the time to say hello. And it's just this? a matter of trying. Look at all these things yeah. that I've got here for this. Um, just to give mm -hmm. you some examples. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, this is the thing that I put in, I have my turkey in it and oh, put it right, in the oven, right, okay, right, and you right, take it out rack. and you go, and how am I going to clean that? <laughs> okay, well, you're going to clean it with your scour sponge. Yeah. The scour, remember, silver, scour. Baked on things on your baked goods, on your baking pans, on your cookie sheets, on your pots and pans, on your grill pans, mm -hmm. on, your, on that grate in your toaster, all of these things. I've got a, this out here to show you. Again, this is about the bathroom as well as the kitchen. This, this the green one has a soft side to it, but you, when you wipe off your chrome and your fixtures with this sponge, mm -hmm. they are going to sparkle. Yeah, like and they don't business. streak no, either, no which I love. And by the way, don't forget, you're getting six of the scour. You are getting 12 of the regular Debbie Meyer Genius sponges. Huge customer pick as oh, well. And yeah. for FlexPay, to get these home today, for FlexPay, that is wow. amazing. Yes. <laughs> wow. And oh. by the way, we also have...